Hello everyone, today I'll be answering the question, why won't black African hair grow? Actually, every hair grows, so when I say grow, I mean retaining your length. Long hair is very good. As you can see, it is what everybody wants to achieve. Men, women, boys, girls, and even little children want to have a long hair. I remember back in the day, my hair couldn't grow past shoulder length, but I had to determine to take good care of it and to have a healthy hair. This takes us to the number one reason black African hair won't grow. Please stay tuned. The first reason is that you fail to focus on a healthy hair. First, it is important to focus on having a healthy hair. You want to have health before length. Honestly, long hair but not healthy hair is not it. This is why you should focus on having your hair healthy. If your hair is healthy, it grows automatically. Lastly, do not do so much for length. Instead, you should do so much for health. Then the results will shock you. Another thing that won't let your hair add length is using too much heat. Things like a blow dryer, flat iron, coiling iron and others will damage your hair and prevent it from retaining length if you use them or use them too often. When you can't retain length, then your hair won't grow longer. If you can't do without heat, I recommend you use heat once in one or two months and you must use a heat protectant spray. You can actually style your natural hair without any form of heat styling. There are so many ways you can style your hair without heat tools. I have not used heat since 2020 during the COVID-19 and I don't think I will use it ever again. Another thing that won't let your hair grow is that you don't deep condition your hair. If I may ask, why are you not deep conditioning your hair? Please deep condition your hair often if you love it. Can you stay without food? The answer is no. And if your own answer is no, then don't starve your hair. Don't be mean to your innocent hair. Because if it doesn't grow, you won't like it. Feed it with deep conditioner and watch it grow and flourish. Another thing that won't let your hair grow is that you've refused to dry your hair with the appropriate material. If you want to have a long hair, I would advise you use a cotton material. I use a cotton t-shirt. Some people clean their hair as if they are angry with it. Please be gentle and patient with your hair. Another thing you've refused to do for your hair is to use a leave-in conditioner. How would you add moisture to your hair if you don't use a leave-in conditioner often? When you go to buy your leave-in conditioner, please include an oil. Oil would help you lock the leave-in conditioner. And please, use this every day or every other day. You can watch my previous videos to know how this is done. Leaving relaxer on your hair longer than it should is another thing that will never let your hair grow. No matter what relaxer type you're using, I would advise you don't leave it on your hair longer than you should. Please always check the label for manufacturer's instructions. Some people leave relaxer on their hair and enter the kitchen to cook. If you leave it longer on your hair, your hair will definitely damage and you don't blame your relaxer or falsy hair or black African hair for that. Another thing that makes your hair not to grow is that you use hair cream instead of moisturizing and sealing. This one sounds like what almost every Nigerian woman does. Let me tell you something. Hair creams can never be a moisturizer for you. They can never replace moisturizing and sealing. Your hair needs moisture every day, not hair creams. If you use hair creams instead of moisturizing and sealing, your hair will dry and this will lead to breakage. Please learn to use a moisturizer. Another thing you do very often that does not allow your hair to grow is trimming your hair after braiding it. From what I gathered, I think some people trim immediately after braiding their hair and they trim again few weeks after braiding it. If this is what you do, I'm sorry to tell you that your hair won't grow. So please don't do this again. Another thing you fail to do when you want your hair grow longer is to clean your scalp. 
Please note that healthy hair growth starts with a healthy scalp. If you want your hair to grow, you have to clean your scalp. I think we all know when our scalp is not clean. Another thing that does not allow your hair to grow is that you don't protect your hair in bed. I've mentioned this in one of my previous videos. It is required that every night before you go to bed, you should protect your hair. One thing I have to tell you is that pillowcases rub your hair off moisture and cause hair breakage. Before you go to bed, I recommend you cover your hair with a bonnet or scarf to protect your hair at night. For me, I wear a bonnet. Another important thing you've refused to do is to trim your ends. If you don't do the things I have mentioned earlier, you will definitely have split ends. And when you have split ends, you must trim them, else your hair will be damaged and will not grow. I will stop here for today. I hope this was helpful to you. If you like this video, please give it a thumb up. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on your notification button for more hair care videos. Thank you for watching. Bye.